This is in response to the Spirator's multi-switch door. Right here I have his multi-switch door. Um, the idea behind this is that you step on a button, those dissolve blocks dissolve, and then the magnetic switch falls, and it opens up the door. So let's see it in action. There you go. There and there. And voila. It opens up. But I was wondering how to make a multi-switch door that it actually matters in the order you hit the switches. So I came up with this contraption. Um, down at the bottom, you can see that I still have his, uh, his lock. But up at the top, I have magnetic switches that um, when, it, when the magnetic switches reach the end, um, it dissolves the dissolve underneath it as well as the dissolve that is in the spiritual's lock. Let's see it in action. If I hit this two, you can see that it gets blocked. If I hit three, you can see that it gets blocked. If I hit one, two, three, the dissolves fall, and I am free from my little prison. Yay! So let's take a look at that in create mode. This is where we started. Um, it's pretty simple. It just goes up, connects, goes up, connects, goes up, connects. So then that, that's connected up to there. Down here, still very simple, but a few steps added. The switches are connected to these pistons, which go way over here and get activated, which are connected to these dissolves. Uh, the uh, first and second magnetic switch over here are connected to the second and third dissolves right there that are blocking the uh, second and third pistons. It's all very simple. I was just proud of myself for being able to do it. Right, thank you.